We're here at the EADS exhibit to find out more about this innovative helicopter concept that uses a pair of diesel engines to generate electricity driving the main rotor and tail rotor. Normally on such a helicopter, which is about a three-ton class helicopter, use a, a twin engines which are turbines to burn the kerosene. We burn kerosene here as well, but we use uh, combustion engines, piston engines, plus uh, electric power conversion system. And this electric power conversion system uh, comprises gen generators and electrical machines. So specifically, what is the big difference? We do not have a gear. We have a direct drive of main as well as tail rotor and can perfectly adapt uh, the condition of these uh, drives to our flight. It claims that a helicopter of this type could burn up to 50% less fuel than a conventional helicopter. How is this possible? Yes, that's right. It's a result of an investigation based on model calculation and there are several facts which work together. First of all, we can use a combustion engine in its sweet spot of operation, so we have best efficiency. We do not have a um, fixed gear, so we can operate the combustion engine uh, setting the RPM to best uh, fuel consumption. And uh, second, we have a whole host of uh, possibilities with uh, the electrical system. So first of all, we can set the RPM, uh, the, uh, the speed of the main rotor to uh, having the lowest power demand. And it's the same with the tail rotor. We, for example, we can switch it off during uh, cruise. When do you think we could see some of this technology applied to helicopters in operational service? <laughs> okay, I hope soon, <laughs> but we have to do our work and uh, we will uh, do a lot of engineering and research and it is definitely a product for 2020.